real estate expert, Randy Hatata from Expand Realty. Randy, welcome to the show once again. Oh, thank you for having me. So, Randy, you've literally helped hundreds of families relocate from Hawaii to Las Vegas. Now, what is one of the most common questions that you get once folks are actually here? I get a lot of uh, <clears throat> common questions. One of the one that surprises a lot of people is, now that I'm, I, now that I'm here, <laughs> what else is there to do in Las Vegas? <laughs> and uh, with that, um, a lot of people are just accustomed to the strip and casinos and mm -hmm. uh, the Las Vegas experience mm -hmm. as we know it. Uh, personally, um, I enjoy the outdoors, so we do a lot of uh, camping, I take my son fishing all the time, um, when I have the time. Uh, there's hiking, uh, we have lakes, rivers, mountains, there's snow for snowboarding and skiing, um, all within an hour's drive. That's amazing, yeah. that's amazing. That's just for starters. And sure. that doesn't even get into Broadway shows and the shows that Las Vegas has to offer as well. Mm -hmm. That's probably why people stay so long after moving here. There's an unlimited amount of things to do in Vegas, as you know. Mm -hmm. uh, you could spend an entire year and probably not get through that list. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. As you know, uh, families in Hawaii come in all shapes and sizes. Everything from your um, newlyweds that are just starting out and buying a home to your multi-generational homes that are, have been established for many years. With Expand Realty, can you service all of these families? We do. We're pretty broad. Uh, we, we are able to uh, service and accommodate um, a lot of different um, needs mm -hmm. uh, from your uh, starter family, starter home, to your starter investment, all the way up to your uh, high-end luxury type properties. Um, and we also, uh, especially for our investors, we're able to manage that property as well. Mm -hmm. And so you guys do that from end to end as well? We take them from start to finish. Um, we start with the consulting, uh, we mm -hmm. get into the transactional and the hunting, the fun part. Uh, and then we celebrate on the closing. Um, right now, a popular trend is that a lot of people today have equity and they're basically uh, trading in their equity to either upgrade or get into maybe a newer property. Mm -hmm. That's wonderful. So one of the things um, that I think maybe people in Hawaii don't realize is how much further your dollar goes in Vegas for your home? Well, cost of living is two to one, so that has a lot to do with to to do with the whole entire spectrum. Mm -hmm. But housing, um, as compared to Honolulu, is a three to one difference. Oh, wow. so it's, it's it's quite a dramatic difference in the uh, affordability of being able to own a home or That's even rent, at that matter. That's wonderful. So do you get, what, what is the look, some of the looks that you see in people's eyes when they realize what they might be able to get for say $350,000? We have to uh, bring them down, back down <laughs> to earth because for people from Hawaii who's just visiting the real estate market in Las Vegas, everything is a good deal. <laughs> so we have to bring them back down to earth and say, well, you need to compare to Las Vegas prices so that uh, you know you can get a good estimate of value because if you compare to Hawaii, again, everything's on sale here. I'm sure people have tons of questions when it comes to buying real estate, especially when you're buying in Vegas and you're sitting in your home in Hawaii. What is the very first thing that our viewers should do if they have interest in investing in Las Vegas? The first thing is contact us. Um, you know, we'll start with potentially a, a Zoom or FaceTime or a conference call. Okay. And that allows me to, first of all, take my mask off <laughs> and uh, reveal ourselves. Uh, but yeah, it's just a nice, friendly conversation. We do a lot of Q and A uh, during the consultation. Uh, we find out what they're thinking, what their goals are, and we try to meet their needs and match that with what works for them here in Las Vegas. Um, then we go on to uh, talking about the financing and mm -hmm. contacting a good lender. Um, and after that, we, we talk about the dynamics of how uh, we're transacting real estate today, mm -hmm. how to start hunting, um, affordability, location, schooling, crime rates, and all those type of concerns that most right. families do mm -hmm. have. Uh, and then we get right into it. We start hunting, uh, hopefully we find some Easter eggs. Uh, <laughs> but, but yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a fun process. Uh, not a, by, by no means is it a pressure type deal. Mm -hmm. 
um, more of an educational type. And then if it's a good fit, then we start, we start, um, we start moving forward. That's wonderful. I'm sure that there's a lot of people uh, watching right now that are probably going to be looking at your website. That'd be great. I mean, uh, <laughs> we're here for you and, you know, we really support like uh, people relocating here. Um, there's a lot of opportunity. And on the flip side, uh, Las Vegas has also allowed people opportunity to move back to Hawaii. So that's fun as well. I know you're, you're very, very humble. Um, and I appreciate that about you. Let's talk about why so many families have worked with you when thinking of relocating from Hawaii to Las Vegas. Well, there's a few reasons that I feel people uh, feel that way. And uh, it starts with, I was you. You know, I, I was born and raised in Hawaii. I moved to Las Vegas 20 years ago, uh, green as can be. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I've learned the ropes here. I've, uh, I've done the transition and I've been doing and helping people relocate for many, many years now. I've been uh, practicing real estate for now over uh, uh, getting close to 20 years. Um, and our company, Expand Realty, is on our 11 year anniversary this year. And during that time, um, you know, we've, we've basically learned a lot and I've been able to share that experience and uh, education with my clientele. Mm -hmm. And we take the local approach, you know, it's not for us, it's by no means a pressure sale by, by any means. It mm -hmm. is more, uh, again, and, and this might be a broken record, but it's more of an educational thing, mm -hmm. thing and if it works, it works. And we help uh, paint you a picture of what life would be like after relocation mm -hmm. and basically uh, draw you a map to get from point A to point B. Mm -hmm. um, and so, you know, we try to take all the questions uh, and the kinks out of the way and the expectation is set up front so that people know what they're getting into and mm -hmm. uh, they can be prepared. Our culture is really relationship based. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's the bottom line. That's what we push. That's what we try to represent. Um, by no means are we uh, chasing a transaction or a commission per se. Um, because in our philosophy, you know, just helping others uh, leads to us to a win-win situation. Mm -hmm. And that's always the goal. And uh, being able to help people like ourselves um, for better opportunity, uh, for whatever that may be, is a really, it's a blessing in disguise. And we enjoy what we do. Um, and obviously, it, maybe you can see it now. I'm very <laughs> passionate when you bring it up. I'm mm -hmm. passionate about real estate and I'm passionate about helping people. Thank you so much again for joining us on Ninth Island Connection. Uh, Randy Hitata of Expand Realty. If you guys have questions, give them a call or visit expandrealty.com. Always a pleasure.